For Luke and Jillian, they have found each other and built a loving relationship with their focus on Christ. This took patience, persistence, and timing. For those that don't know, Luke and Jillian went to Hillsdale College together and had about four years to find each other. But funny enough, they found each other on one of the last weeks before they graduated. Now this act of the story is also dependent on their loving families who are all here today and their personal walk with God. Through their relationship, which is founded on love, Luke and Jillian are living not only for the purpose of this life, but the purpose of an eternal life. Jillian, you've become a part of our family over the past few years, and you are a perfect match for Luke. I greatly admire what you have built with Luke, and I'm so excited to see what is in store for it moving forward. My favorite part about Jillian and, and I's friendship is the support we've been able to offer each other throughout the years. But the thing I'm most grateful for when it comes to Jillian is how she has a way of making me feel so loved and so strong. And it's a feeling that I wish that everyone could experience. For stop loving each other like you do today. Just remember how much you love each other and take care of each other. of someone making you feel loved and strong is so apparent in Jillian when Luke is around. I've come to love Luke, and even though I didn't think it was possible, I love Jillian even more now due to the love and strength that he inspires within her. Luke, you've been the best brother that I could have asked for during my 20 years of existence. As early as I can remember, I've wanted to be like you. Through the beliefs and values that you've taught me, the example that you have set has been amazing, and that's an understatement. They say the best leaders are those that can lead by example. Sometimes it took words, but what is most memorable about the example that you set is the times that it didn't. You set high standards through not only your accomplishments in school, on the baseball field, and at work, but also by being an amazing brother, and I can't imagine where I would be without you in my life. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day, the celebration and thanksgiving we can give as our sons, daughters, best friends, family members get married. Lord, we pray that you would bless them, we pray that you would bless their marriage and help them to be more together than they could ever be apart, Lord. They would really mirror the life and love of Christ and his church and his bride, Lord. I pray you would uh, be with them, help them to finish strong and live on mission together for the rest of their lives. I pray that you would help us to really celebrate tonight, to have a great time and keep our focus on the love and the thanksgiving that we should be giving for something this sacred, Lord. In Jesus' name. I will take you, Jillian, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. I, Jillian, take you, Luke, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. Jillian received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. 
would do this thing as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Spirit. Well, they kicked out best friends, and it's my privilege to introduce them to you now as Mr. and Mrs. Luke and Joey Nortel. Thank everybody for uh, helping us celebrate the marriage of Luke and Jillian tonight. And yes, even though your marriage is just a couple of hours old, that's really what we are celebrating tonight. will go quickly. The festivities of this great and fantastic day are fleeting, really. But their marriage lasts a lifetime. week of Thanksgiving that continues with this beautiful celebration. I have a few thanks to express. First of all, I thank my beautiful wife Anne of 30 years. I thank her for being such an incredible partner, especially partner in raising our children, Luke, Leo, and Julia. I want to thank Jillian's parents, Steve and Zoe, and they truly have become part of our family. She's always been a bright light in our life, and it's got a little brighter too. I love you both very much. Luke and Jillian have been blessed by the Holy Spirit throughout this past year and have especially today as they committed themselves to each other in the sacrament of marriage. Lord God, we pray for your blessing to come upon Luke and Jillian this day and all the days of their lives. 